Hey everybody, Cokeman250 here. Well, guess what? You're never gonna believe it. I'm on vacation this week. <laughs> I know, I know, I know. <laughs> All right, so uh, gonna be doing quite a few videos this week, hopefully. Um, got some of the videos coming up that I talked about before about some of the live frugal, saving money type, type videos. Um, got some uh, uh, maybe getting ready to plant the fall garden um, going to be making some uh, homemade apple butter uh, let's see what else what else I'm trying to pack a lot in here um, don't know if I do a video I might do some clips of it but I'm going to smoke a couple pork shoulders and uh, let's see what else what else um just going to be mainly just cleaning up around the around the homestead here, getting ready for uh, for winter time. Uh, I will have one more vacation. <laughs> I know, I know. <laughs> I will have another vacation before winter time, and that's probably where I'll be doing a lot of splitting wood and stuff like that. Um, I will be cutting some wood this week. Um, pretty much just tidying up, getting the grass cut and weed eated, and getting some weeds and some brush cleared back around the fence line spraying some spraying some weed killer um, pretty much the next big goal on my on my agenda is I want I'm gonna put the uh, hopefully get some overhangs built on my workshop and uh, that'll probably be toward the end of September I'll have another uh, vacation and that'll probably be a good week for that uh, there's a couple of things I want to do before that, and I gotta I gotta kind of save up some money for it. I want to get some gravel brought in and poured on each side of the workshop and around the back. So, uh, you know, I just have a gravel floor and the overhangs and stuff. So I want to get that done, save up a little money, have that done, and um, other than that, I'm guessing whatever comes about this week, I'll just uh, bring you along. Might do some short videos here and there. Uh, hadn't really done done a lot of videos lately, but uh, I don't know if you can see this, but uh, straight forward there's my apple tree. And it has been a great, great crop of apples this year. I got one apple tree zit, and I've got about a uh, 10 or 15 gallon tote full of apples already, and there's probably one or two more that I could fill up with the apples left on the tree. So I'm gonna be trying to put up a bunch of apples. Um, I know I'm gonna do some apple butter. I'm actually, I'm gonna be making a couple apple pies Friday. I might bring you along for that one. Uh, I got some family coming over Saturday for the holiday weekend. That's why I'll be smoking the pork shoulders. Gonna be making a couple apple pies. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna do a couple apple pies yet or I'm just gonna do some kind of uh, big apple cobbler, you know, have a little homemade ice cream. Oh, yeah. But, uh, just kind of hanging out around the homestead. You know, the wife and kids are back in school. Uh, wife's loving her new teaching job. Uh, thank you guys all for your, for your, uh, congratulations on that and a few videos back. Uh, she's truly enjoying it and she's been blessed with a great class this year. Uh, sorry the video's a little shaky. I'm on my iPhone. It's just quicker to upload um, also what you're seeing here and you've probably seen that more knife in one of the uh, one of my earlier videos uh, I used whenever I was making sausage I think I used that one but that's the more robust great knife anything more makes I just that's my go-to knife anymore I, I just more knife man that that's where it's at and then over here you got the uh, Baco Laplander and it's got an awesome leather sheath here that a uh, good buddy of mine, you know, had uh, sent to me. And you know who you are, man. I appreciate it. This thing wears like a glove. <laughs> you, you know, strap it on anywhere you want. It's got a little little belt strap here. And, uh, man, it's just super great quality. Uh, handmade leather. Uh, just very nice stitching rivets super nice 
And uh, thanks, man. That has truly come in handy over the last two or three days. I've been using that Baco a lot, uh, trimming back some some trees and st such like that around the fence lines, and it's just it just wears good. Um, I guess that's about it for now. I hope everybody's doing good. I have got a lot of new subs in the uh, in the past month or so, and I appreciate all the new subs. I thank you for all my old subs who've stuck with me, supported me for all these couple years. And, uh, you know, like I've always said, I, I got the best subs in the world. I'll put you guys up against anybody. Um, and just thanks for all the support. It's truly a blessing. Uh, some of the PMs and, and a lot of the great comments I get. It's very uplifting to me and my family. And, um, you know, I hadn't, I hadn't done any videos with the kids lately. I'm going to try to get them involved in, you know, especially getting ready for winter coming up. You know, there's going to be a lot of stuff to do, splitting wood, stacking wood and all that. So that's where, uh, that's where their expertise comes in. <laughs> so, folks, thank you all. And... This is Coke Man 250 from the land of the free and the home of the brave. God bless everybody. And remember, prep smarter and pray harder.